Street cats are a familiar sight around Gibraltar, part of its character and everyday scenery. And whether you're a cat lover or not, most would agree it's important to maintain a healthy and controlled population. Save Gibraltar Street Cats is a charity set up with the aim of doing just that, providing quality of life to the cats already out there while making sure they don't proliferate. I mean, just last week um, we were able to home two gorgeous cats. One of them was a Siamese and another gorgeous little white cat. Both of them abandoned because you could, you know, see that they were home cats. Um, and luckily, I mean, we, we were able to home them for a few days and through our Facebook page, Save Gibraltar Street Cats, we've been able to find them a home. Um, on Saturday, we were called. We, we got um, eight kittens. Again, we've already found home for them. I mean, it's on a daily basis, and it's not that. It's public that calls us. Cats are injured, cats are sick, people that don't want cats in their estates. We've had a, a, a company uh, who have uh, been in contact with us because the residents there don't want these colonies of cats that they have there. I mean, what do we do with them? Do we go up and we kill them? Do we reallocate them elsewhere? Or maybe we could offer them sanctuary in a, in a place like this, where they could roam free, freely and they could become part of something that the community would benefit. The charity carries out a trap, neuter, release program together with the veterinary clinic and the government. Over 270 cats have already been neutered, preventing the birth of countless unwanted litters of kittens. Of those found abandoned or stray, 80 have already been rehomed, with many fostered. The charity says premises are essential to keep up the good work, suggesting a location like this, the old Tok H hostel site, centrally located and including enclosed open spaces. A good place ultimately has to be the quality of life for a cat, so we can't have a cat put in a, in a cage. Um, Cats, uh, work, they're in packs, there's colonies, you get the sick cats that have leukaemia, they have to be separate from, from the, the healthy ones, but you know, a leukaemia tested positive cat can still live up to 15 years, so they, you know, why not give them that chance of life? You should have a nursery for kittens, uh, uh, feeding mothers, uh, and then you know, an education programme, because I think part of the problem in Gibraltar is that people need to be educated uh, on not abandoning their pets when they can't be bothered, which is something that we deal with day in, day out as well. You can find out more, sign the petition and help out or set up a donation by searching Save Gibraltar Street Cats on Facebook.